Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really good. So today I'm heading down to London, so I thought I would do a little vlog. I'm pretty nervous. I'm really scared because it's just totally out of my comfort zone doing stuff like this and especially the fact that I'm going on my own and I don't know really anyone that's going to the event. I know one person because we follow each other on Instagram but we've not really spoke that much. So I don't know that many people that are going to this event. I'm pretty nervous. It's an event with HelloFresh because I'm working with them over on Instagram. Nothing to do with this. I just thought I would vlog because I'm going to London and it's pretty exciting because I don't really get out of the deals much. So hey ho, that old vlog. Um, Davina McCall is going to be there at this event. Like I love Davina. She's ace. I've loved her. Like my mum loves her. We used to watch on telly and stuff when she used to be on telly all the time and. I love Davina, so it's going to be amazing to meet her. I'm going to try and get her on the vlog, but I'll see how like nervous I am when I actually get there because I might not even dare vlog in front of her. So <laughs> I'm going to try my best. I'm getting the train soon. I've just been getting ready. Steve has taken the boys with him to school to drop Alfie off, so they're on the way back, hopefully, and then I've got to drive to the train station, which is about an hour from here, and then I need to fill the car up while I'm on my way to the train station. Because I'm pretty sure when I get in the car now, the fuel light's going to be on. Because we were saying yesterday that we forgot to fill it up. So, I need to fill the car up. And then I'm going to head to the train station, get on my train, which is like a fast train to London, which is really good. Because, obviously, like, living here, it's miles and miles away from London. Like, if you were to drive there, it'd be like six, seven hours, maybe. But on this train, it's like an hour and a half to get... Not an hour and a half. Two hours and a half to get to London, which I think is fab. So I'm getting the train to London and I'm really excited, but I'm also nervous. So I'm going to bring you all along with me for the little fun ride. Don't know how much I'll get vlogged like down there. I feel like really congested. <sighs> I think it's because I'm nervous. <sighs> yeah, I don't know how much I'll get filmed while I'm down there because like I say, I'm still a bit nervous to vlog in public, guys. Like I really am. So I'll try my best. I'm going to try and get some nice bits of London. I'm going to have like an hour or two to myself before the event starts. So I might do a little bit of shopping. We'll see what we get up to. But hopefully I won't be too scared and like it won't be too busy when I get there because I'm just not used to it. I'm used to like there being nobody around and there's just fields and tractors and yeah. shit. And now I'm going to be surrounded by like people and protesters and like Ugh, it's going to be like a bit stressful. But anyway, I'm going to stop rambling. And we're gonna get on our way to the train station. I want to say hi to everyone. Yeah. What do you want, darling? Banana? I want a banana. Sit there then, banana. Let's get you a nice big, well, like a big banana, would I? I don't think you're gonna eat all this. There you go. There you go. I thought you wanted a banana. Oh. No, you don't want a banana. You want this part of the banana? Uh. This bit? Okay then. There you go. I'm gonna bite it. And that bit. Okay. Are you eating it? So this was very kindly gifted to me from Garnier. It's a self-tan um, oil dry oil and um, two in one tan nourisher and results within one hour lasts up to a week this looks really cool and they've also sent like this dip and tan it's like a lollipop with like coconut sherbet how yummy that is so cool thank you Garnier for my lovely little gift right I'm in the car I'm ready to go I've just said bye to Steve and Woody and now I'm gonna head to the petrol station because the light is on like I said so I need to go get some fuel but I will see you when we get to the train station so I've just filled the car up and it's got lots of fuel in now so I'm not gonna break down I was driving to the petrol station like oh my god please don't break down um, but now I've just put my Google Maps on it says I'm gonna be there in about 28 minutes so I'll see you again when I get to the train station so I've made it to the train station I'm just gonna change my shoes because I was wearing these to drive in but I'm wearing my black boots um, I've got plenty of time, my train's not for another half an hour-ish, so that's good. I wanted to be here like early because I always like to like just be on time, I hate being late. So I'm glad that I got here okay, 
Um, I'm just going to freshen up my little face because I feel like my lipstick's all come off and stuff. I brought a little bit with me. Um, I brought my I brought my mum rucksack with me, but I've put um, my laptop in here and stuff so that I can. Uh, don't even leak on me, please. So that I can um, do some work on the train, you know, because it's like a two and a half hour train. So I thought I better um, bring my laptop with me. I brought some makeup with me, but because I need to try and make it last till my event doesn't start till like four o'clock and it's only half past ten now. So I mean, how on earth is this all going? This all this cake going to stay on my face? is beyond me but we'll see i've got the powder at the ready <laughs> made it to London. I am just about to get on the tube now to Covent Garden to go and meet another lady that is doing the same event as me. So she's saving my life because I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm going to go get on the Piccadilly line I think. I've got no idea but hopefully I don't get lost. <laughs> so I'm here with the beautiful Sarah and we have just been, we have just been to Bill's for some lunch before we head to the event because Sarah saved me because um, I was struggling and I was lost in London and it was very scary but I'm okay now because I've got Sarah to look after me um, but we're gonna go and get myself some Converse because I've got heels on and I've just realized that the brief says that you're not supposed to wear heels for this event so I'm gonna have to go and get some Converse or some flat shoes of some sort. So we have just arrived at Liverpool Street station, tube station, I don't know where I am still um, but we're going to the event now. Um, I managed to get some Converse and we've got an umbrella because we didn't have umbrellas and it's raining now in London so I'm wearing a green dress and Converse and it's raining. And we, I don't know where we're going. And we don't know where we're going. But we're going to get there because it's not far, I don't think. So we will find our way and I will see you when we get to the event. So I am back from London now, as you can tell. Um, I didn't get to film much yesterday at the event, so I thought I would like put the vlog to end here because um, I didn't, like I said, didn't get to, I didn't get to do much vlogging at the event, and I didn't want to stick cameras in everyone's faces and stuff. And I'm too nervous vlogging in public as it is without Davina McCall being there. So I'll try and insert like some pictures that. Um, I took yesterday, like me and Davina and of the other HelloFresh girls that I met that were doing the same campaign as me. Um, I don't even know where to start really. It was just so scary yesterday. I completely panicked and I felt like I had like, I don't know if it was a panic attack or just like an anxiety attack. I was just in absolute bits like there was a big massive camera crew there loads of big fancy cameras I had a mic attached to me it was just totally out of my comfort zone like not my usual thing I'm just used to being here with nobody around for like days on end and just being with my family and like that was just totally not me and as much as I love doing this and um been given these amazing opportunities because meeting Davina McCall and working with HelloFresh which is an amazing brand 
I love doing it. I'm so grateful that I get to do that and I'm making my family proud and doing all these amazing things. It's just so not me. Like, I just want to do this where no one's watching me, no one's telling me what to say and I'm just like naturally speaking and like when I'm behind my phone doing Instagram stories and stuff, it's just coming from me and I'm just being myself. Whereas yesterday it was just, it was just too much. Davina was so, so, so nice. I literally can't thank her enough for being so lovely to me yesterday because I got really upset because I was just really worked up and nervous. And she cuddled me for probably over a minute. We were just cuddling and she's just so lovely and made me feel loads better after having a good cry and sorting myself out. But it was just really, it was just really scary. I'd never been in such a, a professional environment like that where it's so set up and I just couldn't handle it I was just not used to it at all and I kind of like just wanted the floor to swallow me up I cut my finger when I was um chopping some peppers as well so that wasn't great and just like being filmed while cooking like I'm only 25 like everyone else was a lot older than me and I was like I'm not very good at cooking. I mean, I cook and I'm good when I'm on my own and I'm in my own little space and I can cook. But when there's somebody watching me cook, oh, it was just scary. But I'm back home where I belong, where I'm happiest. Um, and London's just crazy. It's like a whirlwind. It's just, every time I go as well, I never get to like appreciate it and like enjoy it and look around and walk around and see the sights and stuff because it's just always work stuff and I'm just rushing there and rushing back. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I'm sorry it's kind of ended a bit, but I'm just being me and that's how I felt. And I just, I don't want you guys to think because I do this and I come across really confident maybe on Instagram and on here and I don't want you to think that it's normal you know, to be so, like, confident and with the being, there's just so many, like, influencers and bloggers and stuff these days that can look like they've got such a perfect life and they're so confident, but we're not all like that and it, it, we're just humans, we can't, like, we can't be act actresses and actors just like that we're just humans we're just like anybody else and we have feelings and it's not easy to just be able to do these big fancy things that we're not used to doing we used to just sit in here with nobody watching us and talking to a camera um so i just wanted you guys to know that i am like a human i'm a normal person and things do bother me and things do make me anxious and scared and nervous so I hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you have got this far and watched me chat along, then I really appreciate it. And without you guys following me and without you guys following me over on Instagram and stuff, I wouldn't have been able to do what I did yesterday and meet Davina and have all these amazing opportunities. So I just want to say a massive thank you because honestly, it does mean the world to me. And I am doing my dream job. This is like the best job ever. I love my job. I love doing this and being able to call it my job is amazing so thank you and I hope that you stick around still even though I'm a bit a bit soft but um I'll see you in my next video and thanks for watching again bye guys <laughs>